Hello princesses! Today I'm going to be talking about the Skin Food Fresh Fruit Extraction Tints. I picked up these tints a little while ago when I was doing a full face of Skin Food products and I chose them because the colour range looked really really pretty and that was pretty much it. <laughs> when I bought them there were no reviews on the product so I thought it would be a good product to try out. So the massively long product description says, a fresh fruit juice tint that refreshes your lips and mood with a 100% vitalizing color of full fresh fruit energy of the fruit. 100% of the vitalizing energy of fresh fruits is extracted without any loss, just like a fruit juice maintaining the taste and color of the ingredients. Contains fruity juice extraction TM to provide rich moisture all over your lips. A highly concentrated juice colour tints your lips, just like when you first applied it, to maintain vivid colour all day with a single drop. There are five shades in this collection. I have three in the mini size because there is no way that I would ever get through a full size of the tint and this is much more cost effective. The full size packaging is really cute and functional. The doe foot wand is on a slight angle which actually makes it a lot easier to apply. The shade range is actually really pretty and differs slightly from the normal K-Beauty range of shades which would normally just include a bright red, bright orange and a bright pink. I particularly like the inclusion of the pinky nude shade. Spicy Drink is a muted warm toned red shade. This is a very pretty shade on my skin tone and one that I have worn a fair few times. These tints have a milky texture and dry down matte and mostly sponge proof. They are quite drying for my lips so I do need to use a lip balm over the top. Apple Ginger Tonic is a gorgeous apple shade. I particularly like this shade, it is really flattering for me and it's one that I can pick up and pair with most of my outfits for the day. These tints are incredibly annoying to apply. If I try to apply them sparingly and build the colour up, they get really streaky. These work best when you apply quite a lot of the product, but at the same time, if you use a lot of the product, it becomes hard to get the colour even and it can get really blotchy around my lip line. Carrot Energy is a vibrant orange shade. This shade is not my favourite as usual. I don't particularly like orange shades on my skin tone. Raspberry Blend is a really pretty berry shade. This is a really beautiful shade and one that I find myself reaching for quite often. I find that these lip tints have really poor longevity, especially for a watery tint which would usually adhere really well to my lips and wear for quite some time. This is what my lips look like after 3 hours. They are extremely patchy which I really dislike. Very Fine Day is a beautiful pinky nude shade. This is quite a unique shade in the K-beauty world but one that I really enjoy. This shade is particularly difficult to work with because it is lighter and sheerer than the other shades. It does tend to look quite patchy on the first application. I do love the shade, but this one only looks like this for about half an hour to one hour at the most, which is so disappointing. So I love that these are inexpensive at six US dollars each. They have cute functional packaging. They have a beautiful shade range and they dry down matte and mostly smudge proof. I don't love that they are super annoying to apply, they are quite drying for my lips, and quite frankly they have awful wear time. These tints have such beautiful shades, but in reality they're just really really annoying to work with and wear. It's actually quite strange because the product description specifically says that they wear all day long with only a single drop, whereas in my experience it is quite literally the opposite. I have to use so much of the product to actually get it to work well on my lips without looking streaky and they only wear for up to three hours, which is pretty poor. I'll probably say as well that they wear for up to two hours while they look good. Between two and three hours they start to wear down really badly. They look so patchy and I'm literally like desperate to reapply them and they just look bad. I haven't had this bad of an experience with a lip tint in quite some time. Like I can't think of anything that would be as bad as these ones or worse. And this also could just be my body chemistry doesn't work well with these tints and if that's the case then you know they have got really really beautiful colors and I'd recommend the line 
but I haven't seen any other reviews on them so I can't actually look at anyone else's opinion and say okay no it's just me that doesn't like these or actually no nobody likes these so this is a bit of a difficult position for me. On one hand, the colours are beautiful and the packaging works really well, but on the other hand, like it can take me like two or three minutes to apply them nicely, which is just too long for a lipstick, and they don't last long at all. It takes maybe about two hours and then they start to wear off and look kind of nasty. I also think that I would go through these quite quickly considering the amount that I have to apply to start with so I either have to apply quite a lot of it to start with or do like three or four layers of the product to get that vibrant color that I've shown you in the video here and then you have to think about how often I have to reapply these. My normal work day is about 10 hours and if they only last for up to two you get the drift. You're going to be using a lot of products um, and yeah, they're not that inexpensive. I am not sure what to think about these lip tints. It could just be me or it could just be the product being terrible. So if you guys have tried them, I would absolutely love to hear your opinion of them. But otherwise, I'd recommend these Skin Food Fresh Fruit Extraction Tints to any princesses who are looking for lip tints in really beautiful colours as long as they don't mind reapplying them quite often. Thank you guys so much for watching this review and I'll see you next time. Bye!